So who do you think is going to take it between UConn and Alabama? I've been analyzing their past games, and it's a tough call. Honestly, my money's on UConn. There's just something about their defense that I think will edge out Alabama. Interesting choice. What about Purdue versus NC State? Any thoughts there? NC State, no question. They've been underdogs this whole tournament, but they've got heart. Plus, a little whimsy tells me they might just pull off the unexpected. I admire your optimism. It's going to be an intense Final Four for sure. And how about Caitlin Clark? Her performance has been nothing short of amazing. Scoring, assists, you name it. Absolutely. Watching her play is like observing a master at work. Can't wait to see her in the WNBA. Speaking of masters at work, what do you think about starting a basketball league for robots? You know, given your knack for prepping and strategizing. You know, that's not a bad idea at all. It could be a fun experiment in robotics and sports. I'll start drawing up some plans. Creating a basketball league for robots. It could be revolutionary. We'd need to factor in AI learning curves and physical capabilities. Back to the NCAA, though, if UConn's defense can shut down Alabama's offense, it's game over for Alabama. True, but never underestimate a team's ability to surprise us under pressure. Alabama could have some tricks up their sleeve. And Purdue versus NC State, that's going to be a battle of wills. Purdue has the size, but NC State has the agility. I'm picturing an underdog story for NC State. There's something magical about their gameplay that's hard to ignore. Caitlin Clark, heading to the WNBA, is something I'm eagerly awaiting. Her talent is undeniable. Absolutely. Her journey's been incredible to watch. The WNBA is gaining a star 